We live here in the country in Oregon and we have a big garden and fruit trees and berries and it's a lot of work but we so enjoy it. It's just a blessing from the Lord. And right, right now we have some some uh, tree limbs we need to pick up. So are, are you done? Are you ready? Yeah, just a moment. You ready to go? Yeah. Off to get those branches. Okay, let's get these down here. This shouldn't take too long. And we'll get them up in the pasture. Yeah, right. Okay. We like to do things with an eye to the future. And that's one of the main reasons why we have made gift annuities part of our estate planning. We like the simplicity of gift annuities. They're easy to understand and easy to set up. With the charitable gift annuities, we currently receive and will continue to receive an income stream for as long as either one of us are alive. Our payments are direct deposited into our checking account. At the end of our lives, the remaining value of the annuity goes to the charity. And we like that. No one can talk us out of the money we placed in our annuities. Not even our kids. Just like these branches are going irrevocably to our burn pile, charitable gift annuities are an irrevocable transfer of cash or other acceptable assets to a charity in exchange for fixed lifetime payments. There are three common types of charitable gift annuities. Mary Beth and I have an immediate annuity. We put the money in, we started getting payments at the end of the first month. Younger donors may wish to consider a deferred annuity. That has the advantage of giving supplemental retirement income upon their retirement or some other set date, as well as a current source of tax relief. And then some individuals may want to benefit someone in their will or their trust, but they don't want to give them a lump sum. And instead, they can make provision for a charitable gift annuity to provide a lifetime income stream for that individual instead. With charitable gift annuities, you can do three things at once. Give a gift to charity, receive lifetime payments, and save on taxes. Gift annuities have attractive rates. The older you are, and that's one time in life when being older is better, the older you are, the higher the rates. Mary Beth and I are receiving 5.5% for the very first annuity that we set up about uh, six years ago. The Lord has blessed us with some really nice potatoes this year. Gift annuities have a couple of tax advantages. One is that the uh, charitable income tax deduction you receive immediately. Another benefit is that a portion of the payments are tax-free as well. If you have any questions or would like information regarding your particular situation, I invite you to contact the Plan Giving and Trust Services Department of the General Conference. There's a 14-foot high bean trellis. And if they do what they've done before, they're going to go up and over the top. We feel very blessed to live in the country, to be partners with God with our garden, our berries, our orchard, and with our gift annuities.